So here's the situation with this in case you want some like really quick breakfast ideas. So I took about a third or a half cup of muesli. This is by Bob's Red Mill and this is the one with the newer packaging so it makes it a lot easier to just pour into a bowl and close it up. To bulk it up you could either use egg whites or if you're vegan, which I generally like to eat vegan when I'm at home, I will do chia seeds. So I did about two teaspoons of chia seeds in there to kind of like bulk it up. And then for flavor, I added some cacao powder. I usually don't like chocolate, but for some reason cacao powder tastes really good. I don't know if it's like the um, iron in it or whatever, but for some reason I really like cacao powder. And then to sweeten it, I use some coconut sugar. I think I took like one teaspoon and a half or something like that. And then I put one cup of water and then I put it in the microwave for like, I don't know, like what, two and a half minutes or something like that. And you get this delicious, easy breakfast. We're here, what is this place called? Del, Del Camp? Cero? Del, 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 Cero Del Cero Park in Rancho Palos Verdes. Kika is having the time of her life. <laughs> Oh, she's so happy. <laughs> <laughs> So the thing with um, Korean barbecue is that you always end up smelling like marinated beef. So I literally took a shower so that that was no longer an option. So we're about to go back to Nordstrom Rack because I need to return the jacket. It was just, it's too big. Um, and I don't have a problem with big jackets. It's just, it was big in all the wrong places. <laughs> My hair is like... No, it's big in all your small places. What? It's big in all your small... My mom doesn't know what she's saying. Peace out. I'm taking everything out of my closet and put it into one central location and then I sort and then I sort from there I just find that it works better so This clothing rack right here, but half of these things I'm selling on Depop. Um, so I'm just gonna keep those there for now and then just like focus on stuff over here. And then I have these drawers here. Um, I'm not focusing on like underwear or accessories or anything that like that which is what this top drawer is here for, but I'm just gonna take out everything from the other drawers. Ugh. I have a whole bunch of jeans. Like, why do I have so many pairs of jeans? Okay, and this is pretty much almost everything that I own. Almost every single piece of clothing that I own is on my bed right now. Look at how many clothes. 
those are in my possession. And this is not including things that are currently washing. I still have like two loads of laundry to do and then that will be everything. But um, this is pretty much everything that I own. Also what I do if I have something and I like the style but I want to replace it with something else or something better, I just make a note of it. Like I'll write down in on a piece of paper like white graphic tank top or something like that. So Okay, so here's the progress that I've made so far. So these are the clothes that I still need to sort out. These are the clothes that I'm selling, donating, or giving away. Donating and giving away are the same thing, so either selling or donating. Um, and these are all the things that I'm keeping so far. Um, obviously, this is not how I'm going to organize my closet. And then these are the jackets that I'm keeping so far, I think. Okay, so these are also things that I'm keeping, but these are all like jackets and dresses. So I'm going to hang these later because obviously this is not organized the way that I want it to be. This is the pile of everything that I'm getting rid of. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just going to fold these up and put them into piles, um, donate, sell, or give to my mom. <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna do right now. Okay, so these are things that I'm selling and then everything that's in a bag right here are being donated. And then I still need to, you know, put my closet together. Side note, the outfit that I'm wearing is also going to be donated slash sold, so. <laughs> okay, so here is the pretty much finished product. Obviously, I haven't organized my bags or accessories yet, but my clothes are pretty much in order. And I do um, organize them by color just so it's easier to find things. And then I do it the KonMari way, so um, thicker, heavier fabrics to the left, and then it gets lighter and shorter as you go up here, so it just looks and like lays better. And then these are some of my jackets that I am keeping. Some things aren't here, and then I also have um, some fuller things. These are mostly like t-shirts and workout clothes, and then I have a sweatshirt that I used today that's supposed to go back right here, so. And then I also redid my clothing rack, so it looks a little bit better. So for Christmas, my brother got me this one, and it just came in today because um, Amazon sucks. But anyway, yeah, I got the Philips Sonicare Diamond Clean toothbrush. This is apparently like one of the best toothbrushes and it'll really help me because I wear Invisalign so basically it's so disgusting but <laughs> basically when you wear Invisalign your teeth are basically soaking in its own saliva. <laughs> it's just really gross so I wanted to get a good toothbrush you know <laughs> you know what I'm saying and this one's really cool because it comes with like this little jar here and if you set the toothbrush in here, it'll actually charge while it's sitting in here. So it's like wireless charging, which is so cool. I'm excited. I so where, we're, where are we? <laughs> we're at Hiccups in Long Beach, California with Miss Priscilla. Hi, girl. Hi. <laughs> but I ordered some garlic noodles with shaken beef and she got the popcorn chicken salad. salad. And there's a side of honey mustard. That's not, I hope it's not honey mustard, <laughs> but it probably is. Another day, another flat tire. Another day in the life of me. <laughs> this is about the, I don't know, seventh time this has ever happened to me in my lifetime. We are really here in front of Denny's, <laughs> waiting for Triple A to get here. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Move again. <laughs> Later. So my brother got 12 macaroons and it ended up to be $23.88. <laughs> Iconic!